Did I not get the thing? I thought I got the thing. Hello, Internet. My name is Blitz. We are back playing Demuscus Current. So, reading this, the incredibly long story, I remember it going on about something in a puddle. Oh, uh, but now that I'm looking at it, this is, I thought this was a puddle here. I'm sure it's been a year since the dampened hole effect. I think they're finally coming. Well, shit. I don't know what to do now. Well, I'm not entirely sure what to do now. Because I thought this was a puddle here. Uh, and then I read all this. And I waited for God knows how long. And I can't leave. Alright, so. No shame, I had to look this up. Uh, I'm not exactly pleased with it. The deal is here. You need keys. These keys are um, mentioned in the book. But of course, there's so much text here, man. I cannot decipher what is important and what is not when there's this much text. E even though key is mentioned a bunch of times I just don't know but apparently the keys is important and I kind of knew it was important which is why I was looking at the puddle at the guy's feet when I was editing but it wasn't a puddle I guess it was just a rock well the keys are actually referring to keyboard keys I would never have gotten that in a million years key comes to my mind shot before try to envision its shape but it's only fitting rich like a broken circle has my image it's shaped, but it's oh, but only fleeting image, like a broken circle, has my attention. So that is referring to C, as in because it's a broken circle. But reading this, I get the impression that that's only part of it. Like that's not the solution because it's only a fleeting image. So much text until the next clue. Only now do I realize that one key is not enough. I recall the second one needed to be used shortly after. See, second key, key in a puddle. I don't know what that means. While looking down at my feet, but its shape is strange. Oddly rotated of about 90 degrees anti-clockwise from the position I remember. And rotated counterclockwise. Anti-clockwise, I, I don't know. I think I've heard that before in like, in like British TV shows. But, uh, 90 degrees. Oh, I know. No. If it's counterclockwise, I get. I thought it was the P in puddle, but now I'm thinking about it. The P, even 90 degrees, is not enough. It would still need to be 180 degrees counterclockwise, not 90. Because, like, you know? 90 degrees anticlockwise from the position I remember. That makes absolutely no sense. Because if the P was rotated 90 degrees, it would not be a B. It'd just be kind of, eh, like a s on its side. And looking at the C, 90 degrees doesn't get to the B. I don't know what that means. Yeah, I would have never, ever, ever, ever gotten this. And I really don't, I really don't like the rule break, like, of point-and-click adventures. If it's gonna include the keyboard, that needs to be, like, established otherwise. How am I supposed to know? Welcome, the time has come, a new dawn for your desk. So I feel no shame cheating on that one, because that was that was too difficult, in my opinion. Stairs. I'm going, but these thugs won't let me upstairs. Is this what is this guy doing? He's playing a keyboard. Chief, wanna go up? Play a game with me. If you beat me, you're free to go. What the f <sighs> Only three moves. Move a piece out on a numbered square to add that number to your sum. Reach a total of 15 to win the game. If you bust, you lose. I wouldn't want to be you. Go on, move on. How do I- what do you mean? Oh, I see, I see. Well, how do I get to 15? 6 and 7. But I guess- I'm guessing I only- I have to do it in three moves. I can't do it sooner. So, how about- if I want six and seven, I do four. 
Yeah, let's... Four, fuck, two... So four, five, six... Seven. What? That's a lot. That's thirteen. That's thirteen, isn't it? It's, it's certainly not four, fifteen. All right, what about you? Not me, ask the chief. Not me, ask the chief. All right. Wanna go out play a game with me? Okay, let's try this again. So seven, eight. Would that be? Um, so let's do seven. Yep. Okay. Six, seven, eight. About five and three, of course. Yep. Okay. All right. Then this this might take a while. All right. How about eight, six, six, one? There we go. I win. I'm the chief now. Fuck you, child. Excuse me. Did I not get the thing? I thought I got the thing. Ugh. Thought I clicked on the thing. Give me the thing. There we go. I got the thing now. My mic is blocking some stuff. This looks bad. Hello. I'm Ty, but there's something over there. If only I could reach it. Oh, glad. Oh, shit. What the fuck? It's sharp. It cuts your face, but it's still too far from your hands. Um. Uh, okay, we're doing this. Doing fucking shadow no jutsu. Um. Stab to death. More blood for your visitor. Oh. Okay. Tentacle monster again, I guess. Um. Boop. Hello. Ha! Ah. And tied, you're free, but strength fails you while thinking of what's waiting for you outside. Alright, well, that is actually all the time we have for this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Game links in the description below. If you think you can solve this game faster than me and I'm just an idiot, feel free to try for yourself please consider donating to the developer as well. And until next time, bye internet. I am not a press every button until something works type of person, actually, which is why I struggled so much in the cat lady. <laughs>